everyone. I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and I am thrilled to be here with you today to share something with you that I've been keeping under wraps and that is this brand new Nera device, the Nera Pro. And for those of you who have followed my channel, you know that I swear by the Nera. I did a video recently which I'll link below on my favorite beauty devices and I've tried just about all of them. And Nera is definitely up there in my top one or two devices. And this is the Nera I used to use, which is the Nera Precision device, which has a little tiny head there. And now Nera has come out with the Nera Pro device, which is basically just like this guy, but with a larger head. And I have used the Nera Pro for the last 60 plus days. This is supposed to be a 60 day review, but Alan and I just went on a cruise for 10 days. Actually, we were gone about 15 days. And so this is like a two and a half month review of the Nera Pro. And I'll get to that in just a few minutes. But first I did want to show you the outfit that I'm wearing today. The outfit and all the jewelry come from Amazon. And I really particularly like this top because one of the trends is wearing glittery, glistening fabrics during the day. And I'm not comfortable doing that with an entire shirt but I think this little bit of bling is very nice and now you can wear this during the day, which is just great. Okay, let's get into this. First, let me show you the Nera website and there it is. And as you can see there, they have unveiled the Nera Pro. It has been kept under wraps. They have given it to influencers for about the past 90 days for them to start using it and get their opinions formulated. And I have definitely formulated an opinion on this device and I'll be showing you my two and a half months results using this device, all the pictures. But before I do that, let me show you a before and after picture that spans the last 14 months, the whole 14 months that I have used the Nera and here it is. There you can see in the before picture on the left, on April 2nd of 2022, there I am. And as you can see in the crow's feet area, I'm pretty wrinkled. Also in the marionette jowl area, I am rather wrinkled there. And then after the first 60 days of using the Nera Precision device, which is the small Nera, as you can see, the lines under my eyes have gotten better and actually the marionette lines are greatly improved as well. And then fast forward about a year to the last picture, which is my final results picture on using the new device, which is the Nera Pro. And as you can see, the eye area has improved and I think I've had further decreases in wrinkles in the marionette line jowl area. But I think over the course of the three pictures over the 14 month span of my using one Nera device or another, my face really does look quite a bit less wrinkled, which I really appreciate. And a lot of people will say, well, do you prefer microcurrent or do you prefer the Nera? And it really just depends on what your aim is. If your aim is to reduce wrinkles, then I think there is nothing better than either of these Nera devices. But before I get into sharing my before and after pictures, my two and a half months results with you using the Nera Pro, basically this is the first at home use laser that is FDA cleared and clinically proven to reduce wrinkles. And they say on the website that it is in less than three minutes a day. And I have to disagree with that. I think it's more five to seven minutes. Maybe I spend more time on it than, than they do in their studies but I think it's a little more than three minutes a day, but it truly is a painless laser and it is a non-ablative laser. And what that means is it does not break the skin. In fact, you use this and you have little pulses and you might get a little bit of redness, but 10 or 15 minutes later, you look totally normal. I do it in the morning and the evening and the nearer people recommend that to get your first good results, you really do need to use it faithfully every day for 90 days. And they say, if you want the best results possible to use it twice a day, don't use it in the same hour. I use it morning and evening. In fact, on many an evening, I'm home with Alan sitting down in the basement in front of Netflix and I am doing this. And I know that sounds weird, but you know, he's used to the fact that this is my job. And so he doesn't think it's anything abnormal that I'm using this little Nira device as we're watching TV. It is helpful though, if you have a little mirror to, to do it in front of, but I've used it now for 90 days, twice a day, and I can do it even without the mirror. It does not bother me at all. Let me tell you a little bit more about the Nira. Basically, it is designed to build collagen. It is a painless treatment. And again, they say three minutes per day and it is safe for all skin types. It doesn't matter if you have a light skin or a dark skin. It does not cause pigmentation issues at all. And here are the improvements that the Nira people say they're seeing in their studies in people who use this device. They say it improves dark spots and circles, hyperpigmentation or brown spots. It improves the tone and texture of one's skin. 
It helps with acne and or acne scars. It also helps with rosacea and broken capillaries. And unlike the precision device, which really I guess you could use this like on your hands, but it would take forever. This device has the large head so it can be used on any part of your body that you want. And in fact, during this trial period, I used it on one of my hands. I won't tell you which, but if you'd like to see a video on the results that I obtained using the Nero on my hands, let me know in the comment section because I would love to share that with you because I really think laser is one of the best ways we have to pump up the collagen in our skin. From age 25 on, we lose 1% of our collagen per year and we really do need to take some strong measures especially as we pass 60 I am 65 just turned Medicare eligible and really since my late 50s I have really been working on improving my collagen and the Nira is something that I swear by because I know that it does do that well now let me show you what I'm sure you've been waiting for which is my 60 day results pictures and again because my life has been so hectic recently with my vacation this is probably about a two and a half month results period about 75 days somewhere around in there first let me start with my full face but in terms of the crow's feet area as you can see in the before picture i definitely did have some crow's feet and then in the after picture they have smoothed out i think a little bit they haven't totally gone away by any means but i do think they are smoother and they look more blended into my skin and then in the jowl area as you can see on both sides of my mouth i have some pretty good wrinkling going on especially in the right side with those little marionette lines and then in the after picture, two and a half months later, it looks like those marionette lines have greatly softened. Please let me know in the comment section what you think. Now let's take a look at the left side of my face. And there, as you can see in the before picture, I do have some pretty good wrinkling around my eyes and a little bit of wrinkling in the marionette line area. And then two and a half months later on June 21st, the eye area has straightened out some. And also I think the marionette lines do look a bit fainter. Now let's take a look at the right side of my face. And as you can see in the before picture, when you look at it overall, the face just has a little bit more of a wrinkly, liney look to it. I have more pronounced wrinkles in the crow's feet area, and also I think in the jowl area, it looks a bit more wrinkly in the before picture rather than the after. And I will say that when Nira sent me this device, I was really excited because I had loved using the precision device in my crow's feet area and in my marionette line area. And I just thought, wouldn't it be great to have such a huge head to be able to get everywhere all over my face very quickly? And I have to say that adding the Nira Pro was not maybe a dramatic improvement on my skin, but my skin had really improved from 14 months ago and I was using the Nira in every month, as I mentioned. Now, let me take off my makeup and I'll show you briefly how I use the Nira. Okay, I just took the makeup off this quadrant of my face. It's only noon here and I didn't want to have to redo all of my makeup. Okay, first you turn on the device. There you go. And basically it's on level one there. I don't know if you can see that. There's a little green line there. Then I'll do level two, level three, level four, and level five. I do use it on level five, but again, I'm quite used to the Nira. And then what you do is you turn on this little thing on the back and it starts pulsing. You're going to hear a, a pulse, a beep, and you're going to move it. And you don't move it until the beep sounds. And you just kind of pick a, a graph of your face, basically, and you're just going to hit every area and you overlap each stroke slightly. There you go. And you wait for that little sound. And I do each quadrant of my face separately, just because it's easier that way. Get a good beep and then move along there. And sometimes I do my nasal folds twice because I just think those are big wrinkles and they need a little extra help. And so I'm not going to go any further on that, but basically what I do, let me turn it off here, just turn it off. And what I do is I do this quadrant of my face, then this, and I do go along my chin a lot of time I do do my forehead, but not all the time I have to admit. And then I also do my neck down here. Some people also do their decollete. And as I mentioned, I've also been using the Nira Pro on one hand. And if you'd like to see a video about my results on hands, I really think it is helping there. And I do have to say that although I think my results were a little subtle on this because I'd had a whole year of using the precision device, I have been feeling lately in my videos that my skin just looks more tight and more toned. I've just been feeling really good about my skin. 
Well, that was a quick look at how I use this device. And again, I use it twice a day. And the newer people say you only really need to use the device once a day, but it's very easy for me to use it in the morning and the evening. I just tack it on to any of the skincare that I have. You don't have to use any conducting gel or anything like that. But Nira does recommend that after you use the device, you apply this Hyaluronic Acid Serum. Hyaluronic Acid is a great moisturizer. In fact, they say it absorbs more than 1,000% its weight in moisture. And what they say is that the Nira Hyaluronic Acid gives you a plump look to your skin. It fills out the lines on a temporary basis, but then the Nira Pro comes in to take care of those lines on a more ongoing basis. Well, if you have any questions or you have used the Nira Precision or the brand new Nira Pro, I hope you'll list information about your thoughts on either device in the comments section below the video. And I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day, and I'll make this a quick one because I think this is probably a little bit of a lengthy video. But basically, I have been working on a happiness project, and I think a lot of my thoughts for the day from now on will deal with the things that I am doing, the concrete things that I am doing to pump up my level of happiness. And this one is a very quick thing that I learned in one of the videos on School for Greatness. I will link that channel below. I'm not sure that I have the exact video it was in, but it's a very simple idea. And that is that negative thoughts are a habit. It's a habit I have gotten into over many, many years, over many decades, in fact, of kind of always seeing the glass generally as half empty. And I don't want to live my last half like that at all. And let me know in the comment section if maybe you feel like negativity is one of your bad habits, but habits can be changed. And the way to change them is to develop a good habit that kind of cancels out the bad habit. And so what this video told me to do is to remind myself to bring joy. And what I have been doing is that every time I go in through a doorway, I say the phrase to myself, bring the joy. Every doorway you go through, say, bring the joy. And that reminds you not only to bring the joy to yourself, but perhaps to bring joy to other people. And I've only been doing that for about the past two days since I heard of this, and I really do like that. Bring the joy, bring the joy. It just constantly reminds me throughout the day to bring the joy which lifts my mood. And if you have ways you bring joy to your life, I hope you'll share them with all of us in the comment section and I can't wait to see you in my next video.